There's nothing quite like this facility anywhere else in Australian harness racing. The Menangle Training Centre, about an hour outside of Sydney, is the future of the sport. Very exciting because everything for what a horse needs is here in a one-stop shop. It's just a marvellous complex. It's world class and I don't know if there's anything else like this on the side of the world. There's just nothing that you don't have. You've got a water walker, you've got treadmills, you can walk in, walk out barns. You've got three tracks, sand track, the hill track, and then obviously your main track. It opened up at the start of 2016. You were here in those early months of it. It really has changed the game here. Oh, it certainly has. I mean, the younger trainers probably wouldn't have been able to afford a farm to go train off, and then they've got the great facility here. They can start off slowly, like Jack Trainer is probably the, the example. It's give those kids the greatest opportunity of their lives. Been a massive part of my career and obviously I couldn't do what I'm doing now without the training centre. It's no secret it's really hard these days unless you've been passed down the family farm through generations to find someone that's set up for the harness sort of horses. So to be able to just walk in here and um, just pay my rent, do my horses, don't have to worry about fence maintenance. If the rain's coming, I don't have to worry about tracks. It's just purely business. It's like pretty much like working an office job with the horses. You shut the barn doors at the end of the day and that's you done. Darren, there's a real community feel about training here. Yeah, it is, Adam. Like, we've got a bunch of trainers up to about 16, and if we need a hand or say you're short of some feed or treatment for a horse, you can quite often just ask them for them, and people will hand it over. We all do our own thing. We're all concentrating on our own horses, but it's only when, you know, you're in desperate need or just some advice sometimes, people just help each other. When people are stuck on farms, and you quite often see that in Melbourne and whatever, they hardly see people around, and then they go to the races to socialise, and then they're in a rush there. But we pretty much can either socialise or stay apart here, and that's the best part, I'd say, about the complex. I noticed being an out-of-towner coming here, the feel and the atmosphere, the horses are happy, so that's a big, big bonus for us trainers. Was the sport heading towards being in that risk area as far as losing trainers without something like this? Oh, that, that's for sure, Adam. Having almost 250 boxes for horses and plus you've got to add the paddocks in, it is a big area and, and they've got room to expand. They've got the facility and the land, so it's only a matter of time the more people that will come out here.